Oh, God. Oh. Oh. You guys okay? Oh, God. That was a big drop. All right, we're doing it today. No more joking around. This is not a... You guys think everything on this channel is just one big joke. It really bothers me. I take this very, very seriously. Okay. Oh, did somebody pee on the box? What is on the box? Is that... What the heck is that? Is that... Oh, it's dust! Oh, God. I thought that was, like, liquid. What? Is anybody in there? Hello? Good. All right, whatever. We're doing it. Screw it. This is even with liquid on the bottom. We're doing it. Modern Masters 2015 Wizards of the Coast said we need to save the trees and use paper packs. The most controversial set of 2015 with a happy face. Because remember, people were so disappointed and hated when this set came out after the original Modern Masters. Cross stitch pattern for good luck. Justin, again, the gentleman who's doing and allowing all of us to experience the box opening through time of all seven master sets continues. And here we go. I know. I, I You know, I do. I wish the security thing wasn't a problem because I thought the paper pack thing was kind of fun. I really did. I thought it was fun. It was unique. But I, I just, the security and the safety aspect of it just didn't work. You know, people were selling used open boxes and search packs and it became a mess. So we're putting our nice good luck letter at the top. 2015 Modern Masters. Here we go, everybody. And uh, boy, these were something else, huh? Pull tabs. All right. Good luck, Justin. Oh, God, look who we got. The creepy guy. Uh, is that the front or the back? Is that that's what she said? No, nope, too soon? Okay. Ooh, the nice gloss. I forgot about the gloss on the cards from back then. All right, here we go. Boy, great condition. All right, and we're starting off with a flipping wildfire and a Simic Initiate. So, for those of you who weren't around a long time ago, remember these were searchable packs. You could rip the glue on the side and get a hold of the cards without pulling that pull tab, which made a lot of people feel like that. It was a very, uh, it was a kind of a oopsie. Yeah, Wizards did an oopsie trying to make these cool new packs. But the pack still kind of had some neatness to it. Archangel. Haven't seen that lovely young lady. Oh, God. Scuttling Rudy. Ooh. So, yeah. We're going to see if... Uh, Remand. Who remembers that artwork? So, nameless inversion of Rudy. Okay, here we go. So, again, these were uh, these are pricey boxes, everybody. Eldrazi Temple. I think this is... Was this still like a dollar or two? Did this go up to like ten bucks? Here we go. And Hellkite Charger. Terrible rare. Foil Vapor Snag. It's, it's sad when your foil common is worth more than the rare inside the pack. That's That was always the complaint of dress the part. That was a lot of people's complaint when this set came out. There was a lot of... Because the volatility of this set is massive. Meyer Smith Servant. Okay, here we go. Long forgotten Gohi, really. Foil Ulamog Crusher. See, that was the thing. People were so angry that, um, that after the original Master Set came out that you had a Master Set that felt diluted. Personally, I still liked it, but you are correct. It's, it wasn't as powerful as the original. Look at that Phyrexian logo. I haven't seen that in a while. Here we go. Glass Hulk, Oracle, Leline, Leline, M11. And a foil, ah, that's our foil rare, All Suns Dawn. Well, we got a beautiful Leline. I think that's over $20 now. And All Suns Dawn foil, I don't think is much of anything. So just laying that out there. Okay, here we go. This is, uh, this is an interesting one here. Combust Tumble Magnet. That was a cool little uncommon. Guild Mage. Ghost Council of Ors. And a Sky Hunter Skirmish. Again, I don't know if we're just getting bad luck so far. Where are the goodies? I know they're here. All right, come on. Let's, a little too soon to tell. We're still early in the game, everybody. All right, here we go. Chancery. Blessing. Cranial. Niv Mizzet. The Gut Shot Foil Common is worth more than the Niv Mizzet. I mean, dude, Noble Hierarchs on the flipping pack art. Where's some Noble Hierarch action? All right, here we go. Here we go. All right, here we go. Come on. All right, Frog might get out of here. All right, Rootkin. Actually, that was a cool card. I remember that. Vampire Outcast, Hatchling. <laughs> All Suns Dawn. Non-foil with a Boros foil uncommon. Dude, this set has Karn. This set has Noble Hierarch. 
where is everybody hiding? What is going on? That's literally everybody watching the video. Like, dude, where are the goodies? Where are the goodies? Okay, reassembling skeleton. Rot farm tumble magnet. A hydra, seriously. Bloodshot, that's terrible again. Oh, God. All right, we got this. We got it. We're early. Stay focused. Stay focused. All right, positivity. Dread draw. All right, come on. Overwhelm. Oblivion ring. That was a good, uh, and there we go. Finally, a planeswalker. Tezzera, I mean, it's not terrible, but you know what? We're going to take at this point. First mythic of the box. We got the old seeker. First planeswalker of the box. We're only at one, so still a little early. We're about, are we even halfway? I think we're almost halfway through. So, yeah. That's all I got. Here we go. Sages. Necro. Worm. All is dust. Finally a good rare mortar pod. That's actually a very good foil uncommon. Okay. Finally a good regular rare pack. Okay. Here we go. All right. We got it. Momentum changing. All right. Here we go. Twilight Guardian. Greed. Rudy's Devouring Greed. Lightning Bolt. And the Mire. Oh. Cathodian. Oh, God, that's painful. What is going on with this crap? All right, come on. Halfway through. Here we go. Soul Stroke, Chalice, Rebirth, Sunforger, and a Foil Strider. So I think my patron, Justin, who's allowing all of us to experience this, is trying to teach us all a lesson and get all the bad cards out of the way. Is I think that's his strategy right now. Artition, Purge, Servant. Wolf Briar Elemental, Flippin' Conspiracy Reprint, Grat Gasp is pretty much... Oh, that's what we said. Oh, God, one Mythic Box again. Come on, this is garbage, man. All right, here we go. Here we go. All right, Algae. Sub Schwister! Noblest of War. And a foil nameless, creeped out, Rudy and... Ugh. Dude, come on, you guys got it just... Press F for respect here. What is going on? Are we... Is this like an X? Does somebody host me? All right, here we go. Spectral Path. Dark. Finally! <laughs> Some flipping good shit. And, oh, that's really cool looking. Look at that foiling. Finally, everybody. A flipping Dark Confidant. Mythic. Epic pull. Fantastic. That is one of the cards that has dodged the reprint, even in Ultimate Masters. Gone up quite a bit. Finally. And I never pronounce this. And ghostly channel. Finally. All right. So if we can hit one more good mythic, like a Karn, even a rare noble high arc, we're gonna be in a we'll be in pretty good shape, everybody. All right. A lot better. A lot better. Okay. Here we go. Ready? And battle, Grace Angel. You're beautiful, and you're not gonna help the financial situation, though, young lady. We're talking financial situation. All right. Here we go. Ready? All right, we got this. We got it. Here we go. And Cryptic Command. Uh, Justin, I hope you need Cryptic Commands. This is your third Cryptic Command. Look at that rebuttal. That looks really sweet. That is three Cryptic Commands in the last... <laughs> every, this is your third box that we've opened out of the seven in the series. And you've gotten a Cryptic Command in every single one. Thunder nut busting crap. I like the foiling, at least. But that was a terrible rare. You know, I, I do like opening these packs, though. This whole paper pull tab, I don't know. It's got a weird vibe experience when you pull on that, though. It's kind of cool to see. Puppeteer Click. I remember that with a Sylvan Bounty. You know, I really do like it. I miss I miss the whole concept of this. I really did. I don't even think most people watching this video even knew these packs were a thing. I have, every time I do it, um, not every time. I haven't done one of these in actually like a year. I remember the last time I published one of these videos... Necro, oh, Necro Skid, or the flippin' Uncommon Dismember's worth more than that. I remember last year, people were like, oh my god, what's with the packs? It's funny how nobody, the evolution and the lifespan of a Magic player comes and goes. And people don't stick around to learn over the years, it's interesting. Alright guys, Tarmogoy, finally! In a flippin' growth chamber! Yeah, you know what just grew in my growth chamber? Finally! Justin, you haven't made everybody in the world angry! Rawr! Ruff. Yeah. I don't know what's going on with animal sounds. Finally, a good buy. I know, I know, Tarmogoyf's only like 50, 60 bucks, but you know what? A Dark Confident, a Planeswalker, and a Tarmogoyf, you know what? We'll take it. Last pack, maybe we'll hit a home run, actually get a Noble High Arc or something cool. Blink Moth Nexus, we'll take it. 
And oh, is that a little Rudy? I think it's a little Rudy Mechanist. Okay, that turned out a lot better than I thought. Good ending. I thought we were going to get pounded in the face. Holy crap. That was a thank God for that ending, everybody.